Hello friends, welcome back to our tutorial, designing an impressive architectural building in Revit 2018 interior. In the last tutorial, we modified our hall by adding more layers to the wall. In this tutorial, we'll break a window seal for this window. Go to the file tab and hover the mouse cursor to save us. Click project. In the save drawing as dialog box, we name this file to 00 underscore 021 underscore BIAB underscore I and click the save button. I will advise you to download this file from the website. If you open the, your own exercise file, there is slight difference. I did some work in the background. Go to the architectural tab building panel, click the down arrow under component and select model in place. Scroll down and select generic model and click OK. Name this model window seal 2. And click OK. Select the extrude command and click the set work plan button. In the work plan dialog box, click the pick a plan button and click OK. This returning to the project. Have your mouse cursor to the face of this wall and click. The face of this wall becomes the work plan for this process. Now, go to the project browser and double click the front elevation. Zoom in to see the model clearly. Select the pick, the pick line button on the draw panel and pick the edge of this window, the edge of this window, and the bottom edge of this window. Change the offset to 4 inches and pick this sketch line, this sketch line, this sketch line. Zoom out, change the offset back to 0 and pick the edge of this roof and the edge of this roof. Now select the trim extend to corner button, select this sketch line and this line, this sketch line. And this line select this sketch line this line this sketch line and this line select this sketch line this line this sketch line this line zoom in into this area select to close this cap use the trim extent to corner to close this cap now I'll click the green check mark go to the default 3d view to see the result click the grid button again and select the extrude command go to the project browser and double click the front elevation select the pick line button click on this the edge of the window change the offset to six inches and pick the edge this sketch line pick the edge of this conceptual mass and to offset it to the left pick the edge of this conceptual mass to offset it to the right go to the modify panel and select the trim extend to corner button select this sketch line and this sketch line, 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 this sketch line. Change the extrusion start to zero and the extrusion end to two feet. Move the mouse cursor from the property palette. Click the green check mark. Go to the default 3D view to see the results. Now click the green check mark button to end the conceptual mask command. Hold down the shift key and your middle mouse button to orbit and see the results. We're going to end this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we'll model a fascia boot for our roof. Go to the V cube and click this vertex. Go to the quick access toolbar and click the save button. If you like this tutorial, please like it and share it to your friend. If you have any question, please leave a comment below. If you want to continue this tutorial or any other tutorial on my channel, please subscribe. Thanks very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next class. Goodbye.